Have you ever found it challenging to access data in JSP? Well, there's a solution for you, JSP Expression Language. JSP Expression Language, or EL as it's often called, is a scripting language that simplifies the way we access and manipulate data stored in Java Beans components. It also makes it much easier to work with other objects like request, session, application and page contexts in Java Server Pages, or JSP. Essentially, JSP Expression Language provides a more natural and concise way to retrieve and manipulate data within JSP Pages. Think of it as a more efficient and user-friendly way to work with data in JSP. So what does the syntax of JSP Expression Language look like? Well, it consists of expressions enclosed within dollar sign and curly braces, dollar tlaichis. These expressions are then placed within JSP pages. Inside these expressions, you can access and manipulate data using a variety of operators and functions. Just to give you a quick example, let's say you want to display a user's first and last name on a web page. You could do this using the following EL expression, my name is dollar, first name dollar, last name. In addition to this basic syntax, JSP Expression Language offers an array of features such as accessing variables, implicit objects, operators, functions, null handling, and escape characters. All of these features are designed to make accessing and manipulating data in JSP a breeze. But don't worry, we're going to delve into all of these features and more in the following sections of this video. So, to recap, JSP Expression Language is a powerful scripting language that simplifies the way we access and manipulate data in JSP. It offers a concise and user-friendly syntax, along with a wide range of features. Whether you're a seasoned Java developer or just starting out, JSP Expression Language is a tool that can make your life a lot easier when working with JSP. Let's dive deeper into the syntax of JSP Expression Language in the next scene. The syntax of JSP Expression Language revolves around dollar expressions within JSP pages. In the world of JSP Expression Language, or EL for short, the syntax is your roadmap. It guides you on how to write expressions that access and manipulate data. So how do we write these expressions? It's quite straightforward. You simply enclose your expressions within the dollar last brackets. For example, let's say you want to display a user's first and last name on a web page. You would write something like this. My name is dollar, first name dollar, last name. In this code, first name and last name are variables that hold the user's first and last name respectively. But what if we want to do more than just access data? What if we want to manipulate it? That's where operators come in. EL supports a variety of operators such as arithmetic operators like plus, plus, minus, multiply, asterisk, and divide. Relational operators like equal to, equal sign, equal sign, not equal to, equal sign, less than, greater than, less than or equal to, equal sign, greater than or equal to, equal sign, and logical operators like and, 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 or, and not, what. There's more. EL also provides several predefined functions for common tasks. Let's say you want to find out the length of a list. You can use the length function like this, dollar, fen dot length my list. Here, my list is the variable that holds the list. Handling null values is a breeze with EL's safe navigation operator. This operator allows you to access nested properties or elements without throwing null pointer exceptions. And finally, if you need to escape special characters within EL expressions, you can do so using the backslash R character. That's the gist of JSP expression language syntax. It's quite simple and concise, isn't it? It allows you to access and manipulate data within JSP pages in a more natural way, without the need for scriptlet tags. Now that we've understood the syntax, let's explore the features of JSP Expression Language. JSP Expression Language comes packed with a host of features to make your life easier. One of the key features is how it enables you to access variables, attributes and properties stored in various scopes directly within EL expressions. This includes scopes such as request, session, application, and page contexts. Now let's talk about the implicit objects. EL provides access to implicit objects like page context, request, session, application, and others without needing to use scriptlet tags. A handy feature, isn't it? Next up are operators. EL supports a range of operators such as arithmetic, relational, and logical operators, among others. These operators enable you to perform various operations directly within EL expressions. 
EL also comes with a range of predefined functions for common tasks. These tasks include string manipulation, formatting, and collection operations. For instance, you can use the function $fn length my list to determine the length of a list. Another feature of EL is its null handling capabilities. EL provides a safe navigation operator for handling null values. This operator allows you to access nested properties or elements without throwing null pointer exceptions. And let's not forget about escape characters. In EL, you can use the backslash character to escape special characters within EL expressions. So to sum it up, JSP Expression Language provides a rich set of features, all designed to make your programming experience smoother and more efficient. From accessing variables and implicit objects to using operators and functions, handling null values and escaping characters, EL has got you covered. These features make JSP Expression Language incredibly beneficial, as we will see in the next scene. The benefits of JSP Expression Language are numerous, from its simplicity to its seamless integration with Java Beans. The first benefit that immediately jumps out is its simplicity. The Expression Language gives you an easy, straightforward way to access data. Gone are the days of writing complex scriptlet tags to access simple data. Instead, you can use a clear, concise syntax that is easy to read and understand. In addition, JSP Expression Language reduces the need for scriptlet tags. We've all been there. You're reading through a piece of code, and you hit a scriptlet tag that's so long and complex, you need a cup of coffee just to get through it. With JSP Expression Language, that's a thing of the past. It improves code maintainability and readability by reducing the need for these cumbersome tags. And let's not forget about its seamless integration with Java Beans. This is a big one. You can access properties and methods directly from your Java Beans components, making your code cleaner, more efficient, and easier to manage. Now, let's look at some example use cases. Imagine you need to access request parameters. With JSP expression language, it's as simple as writing $param.name. What about accessing session attributes? Again, it's a breeze with $session user. And if you need to perform arithmetic operations, it's as easy as dollar total price asterisk quantity. Finally, accessing Java Bean properties is straightforward with dollar user.name. In short, JSP expression language streamlines your coding process. It simplifies data access, reduces scriptlet usage, and integrates seamlessly with Java Beans. Whether you're accessing request parameters, session attributes, performing arithmetic operations, or accessing Java Bean properties, JSP Expression Language makes your job easier. While JSP Expression Language is powerful, it does have its limitations, which we will discuss next. But remember, every tool in your toolkit has its strengths and weaknesses. The key is knowing when and how to use each one to its fullest potential. So let's move on and delve into those limitations. Despite its many benefits, JSP Expression Language is not without its limitations. You see, the primary limitation of JSP Expression Language lies in its inability to handle complex logic or algorithms. In essence, it's not designed to be a fully-fledged programming language. It's a scripting language intended to simplify data access within JSP pages. Think of it this way. JSP Expression Language is like a Swiss army knife. It's compact, convenient and perfect for a variety of small tasks. It can help you access and manipulate data, perform simple calculations, and even handle null values gracefully. But if you need to chop down a tree, you wouldn't reach for your Swiss army knife. You'd need something more robust, like an ax. The same principle applies to JSP expression language. For simple data access and manipulation, it's a fantastic tool. But when it comes to implementing complex logic, algorithms, or any heavy lifting, you'd be better off using scriptlet tags or custom tags. So let's take a moment to recap the key points about JSP Expression Language we've covered in this video. We've discussed the syntax of JSP Expression Language, which uses dollar expressions enclosed within JSP pages. We've explored its features, including accessing variables, implicit objects, operators, functions, null handling, and escape characters. We've highlighted its benefits, such as simplicity, reduced scriptlet usage, and seamless integration with Java Beans. And finally, we've touched on its limitations, chiefly its unsuitability for implementing complex logic or algorithms. Remember, the aim of JSP Expression Language is to simplify your JSP coding experience, making your code more readable and maintainable. It's a powerful tool when used correctly, but like any tool, it's essential to understand its strengths and limitations. 
That's a wrap on our exploration of JSP expression language. Remember, it's a tool to simplify your JSP coding experience. But like any tool, it's important to understand its strengths and limitations. Happy coding!